guys so welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel my name is dr nidhi shastri and today's video is going to be a what's in my bag video but as an md community medicine resident and the stuff that i carry to college to hospital etc so to begin with this large tote bag is what i carry to the hospital and college and uh, this is obviously uh, not real leather and this bag is from dressberry and i keep switching between this and a backpack as per my mood and convenience but i have been using this since the past 3 months and it's been going really good with this it is very easy to carry and uh, honestly the bag is also a little lighter in weight so that also helps now uh, coming to what my schedule is so that you understand why i carry what i carry better uh so we have our opd between 9 o'clock to 1 o'clock this could be either in the hospital or in the uhtc rhtc currently i'm posted in uhtc and um then we have our college and the pg activity between 2 to 5:30 so um i carry my stuff accordingly which can uh, in case i don't come back to hostel also i have my stuff uh, set for the entire day so the first item in my bag is the most important uh, thing for a doctor to carry which is my apron the second item i carry and again is one of the most important things ever is a stethoscope uh, this is nothing too fancy this is just a simple microton stethoscope the next is my college id yeah this is my college identity card um the next one is uh, as a community medicine resident um this is again one of the most important things ever and that is a laptop so if you are uh, you know getting into this field or if you are already in one do invest in a good laptop because uh, you are going to need it right from the day you enter uh, because there is so much to do uh, on your laptop in community medicine for example um, the pg activities that we have to present is uh, made on a laptops our thesis related work is done here the paper and other research work is done on the laptop and even if there is any college related work any department work that has to be done as a residents that is also done on the laptop so this is the most important thing uh, for a community medicine resident especially and uh, so what i have is a simple small dell laptop Uh, I chose a small compact one because it's very easy to carry. The uh, next items are my notebooks and textbook. So uh, whenever I get time in between, uh, say the PG activity has gotten over and we still have some time left, or um, you know if I am going to college and staying there between one o'clock to two o'clock, uh, this is what I use. And uh, this is the textbook. This is the part textbook that I have divided into five parts. And this is a notebook to make my notes. Um, so yeah, here is where I make all the notes. from the textbook uh, so this is actually one handy tip for anyone uh, who is wanting to read park but do not want to carry the textbook uh, along everywhere because it it is very uh, huge what you can do is you can actually divide it into smaller parts and then carry them around it becomes super easy and super convenient so moving on to the next item this is my travel pouch and this has uh, some essentials that i need on uh, a regular basis So the first item in my pouch is a uh, a sanitizer a very important item then next i have a mini brush uh then the next is a mini perfume and then i have a kajal i like to keep myself uh, you know well groomed even if i am going to my college or if it's in the hospital i like to look presentable and uh, these are just some things that i carry this is not makeup or you know anything too much this is just like the bare minimum that i feel confident in and uh, that i feel like okay uh, i am well groomed and it's going to be a positive day ahead so these are just things that make me very confident i have a lipstick which is basically nudes it's from rene and it has like five nude shades so depending on uh, you know what i feel like wearing that day i just keep uh, i apply the the nude lipstick so it does not even look too vibrant because i am in the opd and in the college but at the same time it looks very decent next i have is a moisturizer so it's currently winters in nagpur and uh, you know the skin can get extremely dry so if uh, i have not gotten a chance to come back to hostel and moisturize then i carry this along so the next item is a lip balm from clinic again uh, it's winter here and the lips are getting dried 
to a to a very horrible extent so this is what i carry and keep reapplying as soon as i feel like my lips have become extremely dry next item i have is a tampon for emergencies of course uh, i have stopped using pads long back so i use tampons when i'm outside or you know when i have got my period suddenly and i switch back to cups once i'm back in the hostel and i've sterilized it completely next item i have are these cute amazing jhumkas anyone who knows me or works with me every day in the hospital knows that i love earrings i love wearing them every day and matching them with my kurtas so there's not a day that i can go without uh, my earrings my or chumkas and these ones are rose gold so they basically go with everything these are basically emergency chumkas so in case i've you know i've been running late or uh, you know i forgot to uh, wear my earrings these are like my backup earrings that mostly go with all my kurtas so this was about the pouch next item i carry is this pouch so this basically has colored pens uh, which help me make my notes so i carry this and this has a couple of blue pens also and talking about pens here is a little advice for all the residents and basically for any doctor please carry a lot of pens in your bag because you are never going to find them when you actually need them so probably keep a lot of pens handy and keep them in different areas in your bag so even if you do not find it in a particular pocket or a particular zip uh, they are there somewhere in your bag and uh, yeah this is one of the most important things but you will never find it when you need it the next item i have is this small dabba chotu dabba and this has some nuts seeds and berries uh, so uh, these are a part of the samples that we received when we were you know testing products for our company and i absolutely love these and i carry these every day so in case i need to munch on something um, this is what i munch on if there's nothing other uh, than they sell the around next item in the bag are the earphones the next item is a mask this is an n95 mask and i also have another one the next item is this small wallet that i have uh, this is from victoria secret and this is a really small cute concise wallet it fits in everywhere it fits in sling bags it fits in my tote bag it fits literally in my pocket jeans pocket whenever i'm going out so uh, yeah this is a super super uh, convenient wallet to carry around this has my uh, you know id proofs like my aadhar card uh, pan card etc also has a smart card version of my college id a very random thing but it's a stapler i must have needed it for some documentation work and it's been here since the next item in the bag is the most crucial item but also very underrated this tiny little thing called a pen drive i cannot emphasize enough on how important it is uh, in our day to day lives everything right from the reports to any other duty that we've been assigned every single thing uh, in the department or in the hospital is here so this is basically our heart last item in my bag is this water bottle and with this we have come towards the end of the video so that was it uh, these are the stuff that i carry in my bag as a resident doctor and i hope you found this useful at the same time got entertained by this as well and if you did then please do like and share this video and subscribe to the channel